So they got me hands. <laughs> Welcome to Wendell's Emporium, where our cheap prices are so cheap, they're crazy. <laughs> what do you want? I need a cloak with wing slits. I would like some winter gear. Do you have money? Yes. <laughs> yes, uh, we do. I will count the pennies, but if you cheat me, I'll kick you out! <laughs> I asked about the payment from Keller. <laughs> <laughs> what are you buying? Oh, good sir, good sir. I've never heard your accent before. No, oh, this is my own voice. Can you tell me a bit about your family? You really interest me. Well, I'm of a secret race. I'm a faraway land. And there was an issue with another race on that. <laughs> Ah, so you're one of them half things. <laughs> yeah. you did. There was a genocidal matter. And now I'm here. How much for a hat? Depends on the hat. So <laughs> one beam covered my head. Ten. What if? It's quite expensive stuff, isn't it? It's me! <laughs> You'll find no place better. You did say you were the cheapest. I assure you, this is the only place. Okay. <laughs> can I persuade him to lower the prices? You can attempt to. Nat 20. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that just for you or is that for everyone? Plus my actual persuasion. No, no, it has to be if it's Nat 20. It's, an it's okay. So I'm not buying it just for me, I'm buying it for my friend Nail. He sounds like a douche. <laughs> he's, he's not the very nicest of people, I, mean, I assure you. But Nail, he needs it out there. You don't take his cold. I haven't taken his coat yet. Do not take his coat! Could you do me a bit of a thing for your good pal Nail? Ten cold. Ten cold. I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay. I'm so happy you're doing this voice. <laughs> <laughs> Who else would like to buy from Mandariel's Emporium? Yeah, best yeah. skin cloak. Thirty gold. You said twenty before. I lied. I'm, 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 I'm kind of a dick. <laughs> I would also like to buy a cloak, a winter cloak, please. I thought you wanted a hat. I've decided not to. I just went to the bank and got that. You're <laughs> <laughs> making me go back and get the books. I'll take a hat then, please. Instead of a party pooper. Every party needs a pooper, that's why they invited you. Party I'm really pooper. good at I'm really fun at parties actually. Party pooper. <laughs> why are you still here? <laughs> Can we say <laughs> I'm just gonna so leave. Just I, don't to... I don't want anything from you. Fine. No, come back. Let, can I have my hat, please? I saw a fish. That is all. I will back now, Sam. Now. Wait, come back. Okay. I saw a bird. <laughs> it's pretty interesting. It was pretty. Was it pretty? Yeah. Now, kick its ass. <laughs> would, you, would you want me to kill? If I kill this bird, would you give me a discount? Yes. All right. So where's where's the bird? It's outside. <laughs> so I'm gonna go outside. <laughs> I cast Eldric Blast <laughs> 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 on this bird. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna cast Eldric Blast. So everything's got AC. This is the shot. This is the shot, right? Tossed <laughs> off the Sabrina as Rosa are inside, just <laughs> a deadpan staring at the merge, and the merge is just like this. <laughs> from behind you, you're up. <laughs> 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 and the merchant, he goes... <laughs> <laughs> there we go. So, looking for a discount now? Did what you want? I've got a bit of an itch on my ass right by the... Oh my god, they're still here! And an alpine on it! Never mind. He's looking at you. <laughs> Are you okay? Whoop. Never mind. Kill it like the rest. <laughs> Kill it. Kill what? Like the rest. <laughs> no! He's not, he's not going to I'm kill me, sir. Kill my friend? Shame. I'll give you ten gold for a good cloak. For one cloak. Then no, 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 we can leave. Come here. Yeah. He places his hand on your head. <laughs> Stand still. 
at your first time, so I'll be gentle. I relax as I reach deep inside and grab hold of your asses. <laughs> and you need an adult. I need an adult. I am an adult! <laughs> and he gives you any piece of a cloak. Brilliant. Thank you. <laughs> I'm off to the pub. <laughs> right, the issue is here that. That, that cloak's a bit too expensive for me. I only have like, five gold pieces, you see. So, do you have anything in that price range? Did you try working the shaft? <laughs> I don't know what that means. I thought you were warriors achieving neutrality for your kindness! No. No. I'm not. That awkward guy came in here a little earlier. He was pretty cool. He still owes me a debt, so I ain't yeah. nothing to do. Shut your mouth! <laughs> He's off reflecting at the moment, so. As I said, do you have anything in that price range? What was the price range? Five gold pieces. <laughs> do you have any sort of cheaper cloak? Deceive him or persuade him ass. to lower the price. Or go into the bed. Bit of a cheap ass. I am, I'm uh, poor. I'm a poor man. You can try to persuade, you can haggle some space, you can hold the Yeah. 23. You know the rules. Twenty-three. Do you mind dropping the price a bit? I, I can't afford those prices. Do you mind? How does it feel to be the bronze medal of the party? <laughs> Not very nice. He always finishes last. I feel sorry for mm. Just take it and go. Can I do an arcana to see if I can sense anything magical in the room? Yes, by means. Fifteen. There is a staff. It hums ever so often you hear a hmm. Zarya, uh, wrong with perception. 40. Um, you notice that there is a humming coming from a certain staff within the, within the shop as well. And he just stands there deadpan like this. Oh, still here. I'm just going to walk over to it and just inspect it. You buy it, you touch it, you buy it. How much? Too much. How much is too much? Too much for you. What, what, is, what is this stuff? You want to buy it? I'm just interested. It seems to have some magical properties. What about if we rent it off you and bring it back? Do I look like I thought you were at the pub? Yeah, no, I'm on top. <laughs> yeah, you, you're, <laughs> you're not there. there. Sleep. I used the spell. <laughs> Do you want me to roll for damage, or do you just want me to take the staff and What die? are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> well, I've cast sleep on you. Do they have to do, the sleep have to do damage, though? Yeah. Oh, so the sleep will, can either kill him, and I'll just take all his gold and the staff. It's up to the DM. I'm glad I'm not there anymore. <laughs> I'm no longer Do you want me to roll for damage to see if he dies? I think Five. 23, 28. You've killed him! <laughs> okay, well I've taken the magic staff and I've taken every gold in, bit of gold in his pocket. <laughs> Even lots of them do that, Christ! I'm evil as fuck. Well, right, so you've just witnessed this, you've yeah. just witnessed this. Guys, what get, the fuck, man? Guys, get what you want from the shop. Why did you kill him? I locked the door behind us when we leave. <laughs> Okay. You can literally get anything you want. Why did you kill so him? I go up to his body. <laughs> I take hold him and go. No! Oh, no! It's fine. Can He's you, dead. Can you, can you do it in Carl's accent, please? No. For, for, the, for the audience. No. <laughs> no. Right. Fuck, Chewy. <laughs> as soon as we're about to leave, I cast lesser restoration, stabilise him, and then we'll fuck off and he'll wake up later. <laughs> what? I'll cast a healing spell on him. He'll be because you killed him. Yeah, but he technically has to do saving throws. No, he's an NPC. He's dead. <laughs> I don't do saving throws for NPCs. That's your fault then. <laughs> oh, no, it's not. <laughs> I said, do you want me to no. do damage? You said, yeah. Because I said, I can spell. just knock him out. If it's a spell that has the ability to kill someone, you've got to play it out, man. Even better. It's not my fault that NPCs don't have saving yeah, throws. Yeah, that's fine. Lesser restoration won't work anyway because it only cures like blindness or. <laughs> 
I mean, he might be blind. He might have a problem with blindness, but not now. <laughs> well, he can't move, so technically he's paralysed. <laughs> but no, I could hear. Uh, I, I, I could cast. Words. I could cast heal, but. Uh, okay, <laughs> well, I've taken the magic staff, and I'm guessing I've took his keys as well, so I'll lock the shop when we leave. He was being a dick. He, he was me. being a shopkeeper! <laughs> if he didn't roll in that 20, I wouldn't have done this. I want that staff. <laughs> He just selling goods to Wes. Yeah, so, now we. You were just really. I'd ask you my brother. <laughs> Can I use my uh, deception skill to forge the company in my name? <laughs> so I technically own a shop. <laughs> <laughs> because te- I've killed him. The business now has no owner. Surely I've got his keys, so I can go into his study, take the documents for the building, sign my name on them, and get someone else to work there. And then technically I've got background business and an income. <laughs> I mean, well played. <laughs>